वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स टू द क्लास सेवन मैथ्स क्लास टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट न्यू चैप्टर इंटीजर्स वट आर इंटीजर्स नेगेटिव नंबर अलॉन्ग विथ होल नंबर आर कॉल्ड इंटीजर्स ऑल नेचुरल नंबर आर पॉजिटिव इंटीजर्स एंड पॉजिटिव इंटीजर्स गो अप टू इन्फिनिटी ऑन द राइट हैंड साइड ऑफ जीरो नेगेटिव ऑफ नेचुरल नंबर आर नेगेटिव इंटीजर्स एंड नेगेटिव इंटीजर्स गो अप टू इन्फिनिटी ऑन द लेफ्ट हैंड साइड ऑफ जीरो जीरो इज ऑल्सो एन इंटीजर बट इट इज अ नल इंटीजर बिकॉज इट इज नाइदर नेगेटिव नॉर पॉजिटिव ऑन मल्टीप्लाइंग इंटीजर हैविंग सेम साइन इट विल बी पॉजिटिव वेर एज मल्टीप्लाइंग इंटीजर्स हैविंग अपोजिट साइन इट विल बी नेगेटिव In this example, on multiplying three having same sign, we get plus of nine. Whereas multiplying three having opposite sign, we get minus of nine. Our next topic is properties of integers. Closure property: multiplication of two integers is always an integer. Commutative property. If m and n be any two integers, then m multiplied by n is equals to n multiplied by m. In this example, if m equals to three and n equals to nine, then m into n equals to twenty-seven, and also n into m equals to twenty-seven. Associative property: If l, m, and n be three integers, then l in bracket m into n equals to l into m in bracket multiplied by n. If l equals to two, m equals to three, and n equals to four, if we apply associative property, we will get same answer that is twenty-four. Distributive property: If l, m, and n be three integers, then l in bracket m plus n equals to l into m plus l into n. If l equals to two, m equals to five, and n equals to seven, then on applying distributive property, we will get same answer that is twenty-four. multiplicative identity one is known as multiplicative identity of any integer multiplicative inverse if a be any integer then its multiplicative inverse is 1 by a that is its reciprocal our next topic is properties of division of integers if m and n be any two integers then m divided by n is not always an integer if m be any non zero integer then m divided by m itself is equals to 1 if m be any non zero integer then m divided by 1 is equals to m itself If m be any non-zero integer, then zero divided by m is always equals to zero. If m be any non-zero integer, then zero divided by m is undefined. Rule of board mass. While solving any mathematical expression, then this sequence must be followed. Thank you class this much for today we will solve exercise related with this chapter in our next video